Kahapon sir, may book launch si President Aquino and many are saying yung mukhang kayo daw yung pinapatamaan when he said na when you cannot, and I quote, when you cannot admit a mistake, are you not guaranteeing the repetition of that mistake? And quote sir, your reaction to sir? I don't know. I do not feel alluded to. I do not know what what the president might be referring to. But now that you've read me the quotation, I don't. I don't. He did not say my name, so I don't. I don't think he's specifically referring to me. It sounds like a general statement, a theory on policy. So maybe he was commenting on on on. Uh, the, the problems that we have been seeing recently. Uh, I don't know. I, I, I just cannot react because simply I don't know what he's referring to. May sinabi na siya, sir, na meron daw candidates sa 2016, pero no no names mentioned, sir. There are thousands of candidates in 2015, so... Alright, sir, ano po? Dalawa ba ang magiging president na presidential candidate? No, when I was saying that, he wasn't running. So I was seeking, of course, I was seeking his support. Uh, that is, uh, no, but uh, he decided to run. So again, it, it, that, that's the process of elections here. The people eventually, it's not one person, not one individual, not one party, but the people who will decide you know, who is going to sit in the high offices of government. So, but it, we're, we're, we're just going. It's just part of the process. The whole thing is part of the process. But Mayor Duterte always surprises, uh, not only me, but all of us. Again, he, 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 uh, he, he managed to, uh, uh, he managed to, 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 to keep us interested <laughs> in uh, what, his, uh, what his plans are. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Good, Good afternoon, sir. I'm Ray Remiyo of uh, Unico, Kansas City. Sir, give me five reasons. Bakit kayo baboto ng mga tao? Five reasons? Yes, sir. Oh. Well, they, they think of my experience. Uh, for example, one of the one of the functions of a vice president is to take over to the president, become incapacitated. I have been in every except the judiciary. I have been in local government. I have been in national government. I've been a vice governor, a governor, a congressman, and now a senator. And I think I have a fair understanding, uh, a very good understanding of, of, of how government works um, and how it, how things get done in government. Secondly, I think the problems, yung mga hinaharap na problema ng ating uh, mga kababayan ay uh, uh, dikit, dikit, sa, uh, di, di, dikit sa bituka, dikit sa tiyan. The economy is the, is the, and I, is, is the problem and that is uh, something, that I, uh, that's something that I have trained in. Uh, dyan, dyan ako nag-aral. So marami naman tayong uh, siguro may offer dyan sa parang pagandahin ng ekonomiya. Pangatlo, meron akong programa, meron akong mga sagot, meron akong pagka sinasabi, ito yung problema sa pamana, ay ang problema sa pansa, meron naman akong maibibigay na sagot. Pag pinag-usapan ng presyo, ng mataas na presyo, meron akong sinasabi na dapat natin gawin. Pag sinasabi na hihingalo ang agrikultura sa Pilipinas, meron din tayong pwedeng gawin. Alam ko rin sa palagay ko kung ano yung kailangan gawin. Uh, lahat ng uh, pagka sinasabi, walang, walang trabaho, masyado maraming OFW, may laglag bala, lahat itong mga bagay na ito, eh sa palagay ko nagbibigay naman natin ang, ng solusyon. So I think that is, uh, uh, that is uh, the, good, uh, the best reason. The best, the best uh, ang, alam mo naman sa atin, ang pinaka-importante uh, ay hindi, um, uh, hindi yung, uh, yung pangangampanya kundi yung record yung record ng isang tao at ang um, isa pang bagay na aking uh, dahil lang sa kampanya ko ang pinag-uusapan ko ay pagkakaisa ng Pilipinas sa palagay ko sa dahilan pa lang yun ay sa pagtanda ay sa ating pananaw yun ang pinakaimportante ang kailangan nating gawin ay pagsama-sama ulit ang mga Pilipino dahil ang ating mga ang ating mga uh, nakaraan na ilang administrasyon ay kanilang ginagawa ay pinagwawatak-watak ang Pilipinas kaya tayo nagkakaganto. Uh, siguro, eh, kailangan balik na natin sa pag-iisip natin na tayo yung Pilipino at kailangan natin magtulungan. So, I think that, that, is, a, that is a sufficient reason in it by itself. So, uh, I think that, <laughs> that if, if, we, if we, are to go, we, we are to go into the details of it, it would, we would run 
into more than five reasons. So we, we, the, the, those are the general aspects that I think uh, we should be focusing on. Next question. So from ABS-CBN. Tell us about your visit to Well, the governor invited me uh, and asked me to come and uh, join him in this, uh, uh, on this in the day of uh, his, uh, for his uh, to address and to meet. Uh, and uh, to, to join to join in, the, in, in their in their festival today, so that's why I came. They would that they would be arriving in the next minutes. Yeah. Uh, what are we were well, we were together all of all of yesterday, so I think we're not alone. Because when we get there, we'll be together. 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 We'll Upon the invitation, the good the invitation of the governor. Any reaction to the timing that the vice president is also here at the same time? May you think we can also I think we, you know, we are all candidates. And pagka kandidato ka, pag inimbita ka ng isang local chief executive, it is an opportunity to meet, to go, to visit, to say your piece. So that's why I don't think we should read too much into it. We were invited by the governor, so we have come. Ganun lang naman kasimple. Good noon, Mr. Senator. I'm Tom Tonantugo, Pograncho, Alato and Guest FM Race and Heritage Stock Sergeant. Since the good mayor of Davao has already announced that he is finally running, in yes. the May 2016 elections. How will you equate this, sir, with your quote-unquote loose alliance with uh, Senator Miriam Santiago? Uh, it, it, it has no real effect. Uh, we have, we have, uh, we, we, uh, our, our loose coalition con uh, continues. Our partnership uh, is, 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 is uh, slowly beginning to form, so, uh, now, admittedly, the re-entry the re uh, of uh, Mayor Duterte is a game changer, but you know, I'm, uh, that is, that is uh, something that we'll, we will feel, we will see or feel the effects of as the campaign goes on. Pero sa ngayon, eh, actually, tuloy pa rin ang, ang aming ginagawa. Hindi naman naman, pag, hindi naman nag nagbabago ang mga planning namin, so ganun pa rin. Sir, if I may read your body language, I noticed that you were here in uh, Sarangani and Jansan about two weeks ago, if I'm not mistaken, <laughs> if my memory serves me right. So why is yeah. this so? Kung uh, malapit sa yung puso, siyang Sarangani, Tiyal Santos, and the rest of these. Oh, yeah. Dahil, uh, the governor is here, eh? Siyempre, basta uh, sinabihan tayo ni Gov na dadating, eh. Uh, we, we are the friends, and they, they have been kind enough to be very hospitable to me, so uh, that's why. There's no, again, that is the continuum. No, hindi naman natin ilang pag-ikot-ikot ko. I think uh, the same could be said, not only of uh, uh, Sub-Sergeant, of uh, Sarangani, of Jensan, but it could be said of many other places that I have to, been to repeatedly. But ganyan naman, kasi yan ang, yan ang trabaho ng, ng chairman ng committee ng local government. Pinupuntahan mo ang mga local government. So, kung titignan ninyo, lahat naman ng ibang probinsya, pinuntahan ko rin. Hindi lang, hindi lang in the last few months, kung hindi sa last few years. Dahil kaya na, para, para sa akin, uh, it is part of my job to continue to go around. And kahit na palapit na tayo sa kampanya, I still have to continue to uh, perform my duties as senator. So that's why. Okay, uh, follow-up question to that, sir. Um, dahil sinabi po niyo niyo yan, how will you place them if and when you will be the next vice president of this country, Sarangani province in particular? Well, I think uh, the, the problems that, uh, that Sarangani, the Sarangani prov uh, province faces are similar to what the problems are all around the country, and that is something. So we, are we have, I have put forward, uh, and we'll continue to put forward, a uh, not a program of government, but at least the suggestions that of what what it is that we can do uh, when it uh, when the uh, when the time comes, and I think that uh, these are things that uh, will apply not only to Sarangani but will apply to all parts of the, of, of the country. Uh, so I I hope that I will be given the opportunity to serve in that uh, in that position, and I feel that uh, there's much I have much to offer. Uh, in that regard. So, uh, Sarangani, of course, is uh, um, 
is uh, an important part, and of course there is also special special situation, uh, special uh, context here. But again, uh, we we govern the Philippines as a whole, and that is why the, we cannot. We, we, look, we look at the problems as uh, they are aggregated uh, around the country. So we, we continue to look for solutions, not only for Salangani, but for, the, for all of the country. Uh, what's your update, uh, your reaction again with, uh, especially we have our Muslim brothers, regarding uh, BBL? Uh, any My reaction? To, yes. To, 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 to this uh, update po, uh, with this uh, oh. BBL. Ah uh, well, uh, we are uh, kakatapos lang namin ng budget sa Senado. So, babalikan na naman namin yung uh, deliberation sa sa Lunes sa uh, at uh, pa, uh, paliwanag ko sa lahat, hindi na namin napapag-usapan ng BBL. Because the BBL or the Bank Samoro Basic Law is dead. It's finished. It will not it will not pass the House. It will not pass the Senate. The substitute bills that have been filed in both houses are now called the Basic Law on the Bank Samoro Autonomous Region. BL bar for short. So yun, pag pinapagpatuloy namin yung uh, aming deliberasyon sa Senado, uh, so wala naman, wala nang tigil. Basta ako, may, may kumpiyansa ako, ma 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 kung matapos namin ang interpolation in the next week, uh, by next week, pag natapos yung uh, ba ba barbigay ng mga amendment, eh, kaya pa namin tapusin yung may, may pasayan sa Senado uh, be before the end of this term. Ngayon, ang House, iba ang usapan dahil hindi nila dinideliberate na sa house. Uh, so, hindi ko alam kung ano yung pangyayari. Alam mo, ma ma ang mapapag-usapan ko lang ay tungkol dun sa gina yung aming ginagawa sa Senado. Yes, sir. Yes. I enjoyed the use of 94.5, sir. Um, kung sakali po, uh, papadarin po kayo sa aming 2016 election, um, sa dami-dami po problema na na-encounter ng Pilipinas, ano po yung muna-una po ninyo tutupan po para mag-isulong Wala, wala, na, lahat high priority, hindi mo masasabi, lahat, alam mo, ang ekono, lalo ng ekonomiya, eh, maraming ibang-ibang parte yan, hindi mo naman pwede pa sabihin, ah, ayusin mo lang ang isa, ah, itapos papababayaan mong iba. You have to fix everything, it is a system that needs to be fixed, uh, and there are many things that need to be done. Uh, again, uh, the, 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 the burning issues these days are ang paglaganap ng illegal na droga, ang mataas na presyo ng bilihin, ang walang trabaho, ang mga dumadang, ang magdadamang dami ng mahirap. Uh, ito yung mga ito yung mga simpleng uh, uh, mga problema na hinaharap ng mga ating mga mamamayang araw-araw. Yun ang dapat natin unahin. Sa palagay ko, um, bilang vice presidente ay kay marami tayong magagawa na hindi naman kailangan palitan ng pulisya ng gobyerno. Pagandahin lang natin ang patakbo ng gobyerno. And yun na siguro Ang una natin, before, before we try to change the world, we have to change ourselves. So, let us, uh, let us, uh, let us uh, start with the government itself. Uh, ayusin natin ang patakbo ng gobyerno, more efficient, more responsive, more sensitive to the people. And I think in that regard, ma matutubo na na ang mga ibang ibang problema ng, uh, ng, uh, ng ating bansa. Mr. Senator, uh, I am following Fred Casino, uh, representative of United States of Mandalorian. To the uh, my question is, uh, how comprehensive is your concern for the Indigenous people? Well, I, uh, I think it is that, that has been demonstrated in the work that we did for the IPC in uh, in, uh, re, re, uh, in rewriting and, uh, re, and writing a substitute bill uh, during for the Bangsamoro uh, for the Bangsamoro region for the Bangsamoro Autonomous Region. At doon ay pinaglaban namin ng mabuti kasi yung original person na ibinigay sa amin ay wala masyadong nabanggit tungkol sa IPs. At tiniyak namin doon sa aming substitute uh, version, tiniyak namin na ang, uh, uh, ang IPRALO ay uh, maging, maging uh, maliwanag na maliwanag na lahat ng mga karapatan at tribileho na ibinigay sa mga IP ng IPRALO ay kikilalanin ng pamahalaan ng Bangsamoro. Uh, kaya naman eh, I, I think the the, uh, the the upshot of it is that we just have ang ang aming prinsipyo diyan ay ang aking sinasabi na what pwede nating dagdagan ang ating ibibigay sa IP pero wag nating babawasan dun sa ipla yun ang basis yun ang parang ibig sabihin yun ang minimum
kung sakali man, kung ano man ang ating uh, gagawin when it comes to the IPs, their ancestral lands, uh, their cultures, and their traditions. Yeah, exactly, uh, Mr. Senator, because that was uh, one of our concerns when we had our conventions in Davao City uh, among the IPMRs, and we said that uh, that's one of, uh, constitute one of our fears that uh, the IPRA, as it is, uh, it is being considered as the framework for development of the indigenous people and if this BBL will push through then uh, can it be uh, uh, protected under the new scheme or under the new framework. So the, that's our thing. The IPRA is a national law yes. and no, no uh, Sangunian, no local uh, government can uh, uh, can, can, can amend or can repeal or can violate uh, that law. And it can only be done by an act of Congress. So that is something that we, we can guarantee. Uh, if you read the, the substitute bill, you will see very clearly that there are several, not only one, but several mentions of the, of the rights of indigenous peoples uh, within the Bangsamoro region. So that is something that uh, we have made sure is, uh, is very clearly understood and is very clearly stated, expressly stated in the basic law. Thank you, Mr. Senator. Next question from Sunshine. Uh, uh, Mr. Senator, um, tuloy-tuloy uh, tuloy -tuloy na talaga ang laban ni Liam Duterte. Uh, kanina lang, uh, pinirman na niya kanyang COC for President. Nag-withdraw na rin siya ng kanyang COC uh, as mayor at ang um, kapalit ay si Mayor Inday. So, ano yung napag-usapan ninyo ni Mayor Duterte? Um, Al alam nyo, every time, every time I'm in Davao, pinupuntahan ko naman lagi si Mayor Duterte. Kaya uh, kahit na wala kami ng specific na pag-uusapan, pinupuntahan ko siya. At uh, kaibigan ko, matagal ko ng kaibigan yan eh. At uh, we get along very well, so pinupuntahan ko siya. And that's basically, syempre napapag-usapan namin ng politika. Eh, Tinutokso ko nga siya, ginugulat mo naman kami na bigla kang tatako ulit. Na sabi ng gano'n. So, but that's okay. I mean, that's part of politics. And, um, uh, siyempre, tinatanong ko siya, oh, paano ka nag-design? Paano ka nag-design? I'll, I'll let you, I'm sure he's coming along soon. I'll let him explain that to you. Uh, of course, the, the, there are others. The, uh, ako naman, ang tingin ko, magandang, magandang sitwasyon ko eh. Dahil, tignan niya yun, yung lahat ng presidential candidates, ay yung si, si Vice President, may lahing tiga norte. Oh, si Mar Rojas, pinsan ng aking asawa. Si Mayor Duterte, matali kong kaibigan. Si Miriam, idol ko. O, sino pa nga naman? Wala ako ng pro. Lahat, lahat. <laughs> lahat in, in tayo. So, ako, medyo kampante ako dito sa, dito sa election. Eh. <laughs> okay, last question. O, di nyo naisip yun, ano? Magaling ko. Kailangan mong planning na ngayon, forward planning. Last question, Prof. Yes, sir. Sali ko dito. Hi. Hello. Good morning. Uh, sir, uh, ano ba sa inyo sa tingin niyo yung epekto nito na katapos sa pinag-10 billion pesos yung inalat na budget ko dito? Ayun ang ating inaantay. Uh, kung ano ba talaga, alam niyo unang-una, kailangan talaga. Siyempre, maraming nananakyan na 10 billion. Pero ito ay ating, uh, pa, ating uh, itong konferensya nito, talagang kailangan natin tiyakin na walang masamang nangyari. At sa awa ng Diyos, wala naman talaga masamang nangyari. Ngayon, kahit na malaking, malaking pera ang 10 billion pesos, Kung talaga ang ating, ang ating gobyerno at ang ating mga economic managers ay nakakuha ng mga gandang trade agreement na, na iiral for, na, for the next many years, eh, palagay ko kayang-kayang natin bawihin yung 10 billion na yun. Kaya, pero titignan natin, hindi pa natin nakikita ang mga report ng, uh, ng, kung ano ang, na, ang nangyari sa Pilipinas, kung anong nakuha ng Pilipinas, ano yung... Uh, uh, ano yung mga madadalang kabutihan at, uh, na, pa, pa, sa ating mga sa ating mga mamamayan. So, I, I, I'm still, I'm first, I am happy that the APEC went through na walang problema. Well, ano, uh, I'm very proud. Meron pa tayong ipinagmamalaki ng mga PICC kung saan kinundakt yung mga conference. Meron tayong mga lugar na kahit papano hindi tayo mapapahiya. Uh, walang nangyari na hindi ka nais-nais. So, Great. The time, I always said, yeah, you know, pagka ganyan, mga international content, it's our time to shine. 
So we should instead of binabatikus natin kung ano yun nangyari, we should encourage them and be supportive. And it, it is not for us, this is not for one person or one party, this is for the Philippines. Eh, pagka for the Philippines, eh, everybody together na, huwag na tayong ano. Pero siyempre, kailangan, the, the, our, our government and the and our department secretaries and especially our trade and financial uh, managers should uh, should have taken the, should have, should take advantage of any such opportunity i hope they have we will see we will see uh, when 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 we learn more about what these uh, what the conclusions were ano pa ano talaga nangyari maraming mga naging discussion maraming naging private meeting maraming naging bilateral meeting so uh, kailangan pa natin malaman. I, I hope that uh, meron silang maipapalita sa atin na magiging, uh, magiging parya yung 10 billion na ginastos natin dun sa makukuha natin sa konferensya nito. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.